Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It is Jenny's from Words to My Daughter and I'm back with another video for you guys today. It's been a while, but I'm happy to be back. I'm starting off this video or this uh, return <laughs> to YouTube with a what me and my toddler eat in a day. I am partaking on a journey of a health and fitness journey. Uh, I set goals for this year to basically just get my health and fitness in order. I set goals for a lot of things, for business, for personal, for spiritual, but um, I'm gonna give you guys a glimpse into some of the goals <laughs> I have for my health and fitness today. So that obviously includes what I eat, what my toddler eats, what I'm meal prepping. So that is what you guys are gonna see today. So if you're interested in seeing what you can eat, what you can meal prep, healthy, to start your 2021 goals, then just keep on watching. So it is 8.45 in the morning. I already, <laughs> excuse all the kids in the background. I already did my workout this morning. I got up at 5 a.m., which is also a goal I set to start getting up really early so that I can start real life, back here, real life. So I can start uh, just working out, reading my Bible, having personal time before Ezzy wakes up. So that went well today. So it is only 8.45, like I said. I have actually been, um, Intermittent fasting, I guess you would see, say, I've been having my first meal around 12, one o'clock, so I'm not gonna eat yet, um, but I am making Ezzy's food, so I'm just gonna show you guys what I'm making her. I meal prep on, well now on Sundays, so this is stuff that I meal prepped. I'm gonna give you guys little clips throughout the video so you can see like kind of how I meal prepped, how I cooked it, but um, for the most part today, it's just gonna be popping on a plate, put it in the microwave. So first off, we have Ezzy's breakfast. So, Ezzy is having buckwheat. This is the big container I make um, basically for the week so I can just put it into a bowl for her to eat and I don't have to be in the kitchen cooking. Um, this is some homemade almond milk and I just like to add fat in there before I um, warm it up just so it's not so dry because obviously after it's in the fridge, it gets a little stiff. But um, yeah, so I just put some milk in there, warm it up so it gets nice and uh, back to pretty much as if it was fresh and then I give that to her so that is what she's going to be eating this morning and once we get on with the day and once 12 one o'clock hits I'll let you guys know what I'm gonna be eating It is now 1230 and I am having my first meal of the day. Um, here I have some strawberries and two scrambled eggs which is salt and pepper. I usually put spinach in my eggs but since I'm eating it alongside with a smoothie, figure we can skip that. Um, my smoothie has mixed greens which has chard, kale, spinach, and then I also have a protein powder in here, the collagen, um, collagen protein by Vital, uh, Vital Proteins, I believe is the brand. And I have um, blueberries, strawberries, flax seeds, and spirulina. So that is my smoothie and my eggs and my strawberry. I'm going to enjoy this. So I'll catch you guys uh, with the next meal. Someone's request, she just woke up from her nap. So she wants a banana and some apples that I already have sliced up. So hopefully she likes it because she likes when they're more ripe because they're sweeter. I've noticed that when they're like just <laughs> ripe, she kind of plays around with it. So we'll see. Is it yummy? All right, guys, I am back for lunchtime. Um, it is about three o'clock. 3.15, Ezzy just finished having her lunch, which was um, apples and a uh, banana. She slept pretty long, longer than I was expecting, because she went down for her nap around 11, and she got up at like, what was it, 1.30-ish? 
145, somewhere around there. So I gave her a snack, and so now it's three o'clock, we're having lunch, and this is what we're eating. Here we have a pasta. This is a pasta bake. Um, I used brown rice pasta, and I added spinach, I added Applegate Organics uh, Italian chicken sausage, and I added Primal Kitchen pasta sauce. I'm gonna show you guys some clips of me making that because I meal prepped it. healthy and um, I added just some strawberries and blueberries for Ezzy to have alongside hers. So this is what we're eating and she's at the table ready. Let's see how well this goes. You ready to eat? Mm. So I'll check back in with you guys to let you know how it goes as far as if she eats her food because you know toddlers they can be picky and uh she's picky for sure plus she's been begging for pancakes and i didn't give her pancakes so <laughs> i'm trying to stay on top of eating because i'm really bad with that i'm usually eating like once or twice a day and um it's just not good so i'm trying to get better at smaller meals multiple times a day as opposed to like one or two huge meals that aren't the best and um, we're gonna see how this works out for me because your girl is on a fitness journey. So <laughs> and I'm gonna like show, um, I kind of put it up on my stories and on my Instagram, just talking about like kind of goals. And um, I took pictures of how my body is right now so that as we go along on this fitness and health journey, we kind of see how things are going, you know? And um, I'm actually gonna be filming a health and fitness routine um, coming soon within the next couple of days. So that video is gonna be up after this one, just to give more insight into what I'm trying to do, um, the goals I've set and uh, how I'm gonna be reaching these goals. So if you guys are interested in that, just stay tuned. Cause you know, mom life, we got this postpartum bodies. We're still trying to get together. And um, yeah, so I'll catch back in with you guys whenever we decide to eat something else. So we have a little bit of a mess. Ezzy, come here. Um, looks like we're gonna have to change her uh, clothes because she got pasta sauce all over, of course. But she did eat actually more than I was expecting, so I'm proud. I'll say it's a success. <laughs> so, if you guys are looking for um, any kind of kid friendly meal, a little healthier than um, your typical pasta, then definitely try this out. And of course I devoured mine because uh, it was So gone. not very long after, it's just been a few minutes since we finished our lunch, but I am just in need of a pick me up since I was up at five this morning. So I'm about to just make an afternoon coffee and Ezzy is now drinking her smoothie. Um, the same smoothie I had earlier today. She's just having it right now. Is it good? Yeah. You're gonna get a brain freeze, slow down. <laughs> <laughs> it's yummy. Okay, the mirror. The mirror? It's crazy. <laughs> I can't. For my afternoon pick me up, I'm just having a quick coffee. I'm going to use the Nut Pods creamer. This is their original flavor. I love this creamer because it has zero sugar and um, it's dairy free. It has all the little stuff right here plant based, unsweetened, dairy free, non GMO, soy free carrageenan free keto friendly paleo friendly and um yeah i love this stuff it's very very creamy and i just love a creamy like creamy coffee it's so good so uh this is what i'm about to make and i'm really excited because i don't know i feel like i didn't really enjoy my coffee today i don't know maybe because i was rushing to like get to my workout but the way i usually enjoy my coffee and like sit and like I didn't do that today. So I think I'm really excited to just enjoy, like slow down. I have nothing else to do today. Our homeschooling is done, workout. Um, 
work pretty much for the day is done except for obviously continuing to vlog what I eat today but other than that like all my work's pretty much done so I feel excited to um, be done and have nothing on my to-do list I did all the laundry <laughs> I'm kind of the game this week so I'm really excited so I'm really about to enjoy this coffee <laughs> It is 6.30 p.m. and we are about to have dinner. And I'm just gonna show you guys what we're eating. Um, very simple, easy <laughs> dinner. And uh, that's how I like it, cause ain't nobody got time. So I'm having tuna on toast with some Simple Mills crackers. This is actually the Easy Heal toast. So it's all sprouted and um, organic and the ingredients are really good. There's no flour in this spread, so I really like it. As he's having the same thing, more of a sandwich, Simple Mills crackers, once upon a farm pouch, which I like, it has apple, banana, kale, and hemp seeds. I like to put some of the Primal Kitchen mayo on my bread and I use the Wild Planet tuna, which is sustainable and line caught, so good healthy stuff and I'm really excited to eat it all right guys so that's gonna conclude this video this is what I and my toddler eats in a day um I hope you guys enjoyed it I hope you got some ideas on what you can get by make for you and your kids I am actually about to start editing this video right now so that could be up tomorrow it's Monday so it is bachelor night which I'm so excited for so um I'm also gonna have some wine tonight so just so you guys know that's also in my what i eat drink and i've been drinking water all day just so you know i haven't been uh posting much about it but that pink bottle has been with me along the whole journey <laughs> so um hope you guys enjoyed it don't forget to subscribe down below like this video and um follow me on instagram and i will catch you guys in the next one